And it's coming up on 23 minutes to the hour this week on Daybreak. We are recognizing our heroes here throughout the Valley. My two and a half years working for WHSV News 3 have been personally moved by many groups here in the Valley, but one organization left a special mark on me, proving that beauty is in the eye of the beholder and the will in someone's heart. Beauty, elegance, grace. While these three words describe the Miss America pageant, there aren't enough words to describe these ladies. Meet Rose Williams, crowned Miss Wheelchair Virginia 2008. I feel very proud of my accomplishment. That, that is the table that is built. Rose spent a year touring the state representing people with disabilities, like Emily McGrail. She didn't win the crown in 2009, but the pageant isn't necessarily about that. Showing that we're not giving up and we're, we're ready to compete and see what we can do. It gave me a positive focus. It gave me, this is, this is pretty radical, but it, some mornings it gave me a reason to get up. Pam Cobbler, crowned in 2004, suffered an injury in 2001, leaving her wheelchair bound. Down and depressed, it took her three years to find her purpose. She currently acts as the pageant's executive director. There are uh, still a few stereotypes out there. I, we've made a lot of progress, but I believe that more work needs to be done. Miss Virginia Caressa Cameron! I like the camaraderie of all of us ladies getting together. I'm thankful that I was able to be with this, these extraordinary women. The Wiss Wheelchair Virginia.